name is Gene Krapfelder. I've been here teaching with Sean here for about 12 years. Um, I really enjoy teaching here. I did retire in January and decided to come back even after retirement. Um, it's a great job. It's very enjoyable uh, just to teach here. I mean, the people here are great. The students seem like they want to learn something and they have the great opportunities. The, the, the school itself is probably one of the better schools in the state as far as uh, aviation goes. Between Sean and I, we have over 85 years experience teaching or working in aviation, so we got a lot of experience here. Plus, the, the students here get a lot out of it because they get our experiences from working on airplanes also, from the time we worked on airplanes. So it's not only basic stuff they get, they get to get a lot of information concerning outside world, meaning big airplanes, airlines. Example of that is I worked airlines, Sean works a lot of small airplanes, so we got a good combination here. I'm Sean Tomlin. Uh, one of the instructors here at night um, with our partnership that we have with Southern State and Laurel Oaks. Uh, we teach uh, a two-year program. Uh, the students come in knowing uh, nothing about aviation and they go out aircraft mechanics, federally licensed aircraft mechanics, able to work anywhere uh, in the United States and for that matter anywhere in the world on uh, U.S. registered aircraft. So that is what we were after. Um, the program's two years, uh, four semesters, uh, two semesters the first year, then a summer break, and then two semesters the second year. Um, I've been here and we've had this program in existence with Southern State and Laurel Oaks. The partnership has been there for uh, 10 years. So the first year you will go uh, um, general and airframe disciplines and then you're Second year, you'll be power plant discipline, and you'll come out as a federally licensed aircraft mechanic after you pass your test and uh, jump through a couple hoops for the federal government. You'll be able to work anywhere in the United States, uh, and for that matter, all over the world if they're uh, U.S. registered aircraft. Um, so we, we are mechanics. We do travel with airplanes. We get to fly with airplanes. We get to have a lot of fun. Um, currently, there is a lot of open jobs and open positions in the aviation industry uh, that are good paying. Uh, right now our students uh, when they're exiting schools have standing offers from a couple different uh, MROs and airlines starting out at uh, just around $30 an hour and uh, airlines like UPS down in Louisville, uh, Delta that is in uh, Cincinnati, uh, they're topping out in the $60 an hour range, some of them as high as $70 an hour. Uh, they, they, airlines look at this as a $100,000 a year job when they give you a job. Uh, if you get a job with airlines, you get a lot of flight benefits with them, uh, a lot of kind of special, special treatment when you're an aircraft mechanic for an airline. Uh, Gene and I have both been aircraft mechanics for airlines, so we've both been in, involved in that. I was a flight uh, mechanic for about six years, so what I did with a cargo outfit, anywhere that airplane went, I flew with it, so you had to know the airplane pretty well, but I, truthfully, I got to see the entire world. I got to go to Great Wall of China, I've been to Beijing, you've named a country and I've been there in aviation. So, and it, you know, it does it for your job, so you can't beat something like that. You know, I would never see that kind of stuff if I wasn't in aviation, never. You have an opportunity to travel the world with a good paying job right here in Clinton County. Uh, all you need to do is sign up, classes start August 21st.